Students at Centennial College's Centre for Creative Communications campus are taught how to communicate effectively. Oddly enough, there is yet to be a student-run radio forum where students can showcase their talents. James Rock is a broadcast and film student who wants to change that with the multi-campus radio service. It originally came about due to the fact that um, I had thought that we were at the Centre for Creative Communications. Uh, it's a lot of creativity bouncing back and forth and uh, I felt that uh, not having a radio station was uh, detrimental to the whole of the society that we're building here, right? Everybody's trying to put something in and they don't have anywhere to put it. The service is just getting off the ground and it needs to garner more attention and support from students before its official launch in September. Ted Fairhurst is an experienced broadcaster and professor in Centennial College's broadcast program. He's been brought on board to oversee the project. It's a matter of a developing vision, really. Um, the original conception, which, you know, that we're taking, going ahead with is a radio service that's directed at the students and the community, the larger community of Centennial College. So that on the one hand, it gives Centennial's students an opportunity to actually do radio. That is, they can come in and do a show, uh, or they can, uh, and or they can work behind the scenes on producing. They can do field work, they can go out in uh, events and cover events. The radio station hasn't been named yet, but Rock is planning to hold some sort of contest to decide on one. It'll be going on a test run this summer, and its success will determine the future of the station. Greg Masick, Observer Radio News, Toronto.